puzzling corner. Now, on this channel, we do puzzles. We love puzzles. Work on some puzzles. Solve some puzzles. Or review some puzzles. I seem to have a whole lot of fun here, guys. So if you're into that sort of thing, make sure you hit on that subscribe if you haven't already. Pound on that like button. Hit that notification bell. You will get notified when I get another puzzle video out there, guys. Now, ah, puzzles, baby. Love puzzles. Speaking of love of puzzles, guys, yeah, make sure you guys comment boom on uh, one of these, uh, one of these either the Eco Decor or one of these, uh, this video here, you know, comment boom to win you guys a free homie on a puzzle, baby. I will enter you into the drawing. And uh, by the way, the drawing is next episode, guys. You guys just got a few more days. And somebody's winning a homie on a puzzle, baby, because that's what we do. Puzzles. Yeah. Now, on with today's show, guys. Like I said, great, great show, guys. What are you guys playing today? And uh, like uh, like always, guys, wait. Hold on, what's it? Uh, breaking news, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, this just in. Phil Wickfield, Metal Puzzles UK, baby, has just dropped Bolted, baby, boom! Check this bad man jam out. This is called Bolted from, uh, this is from my man Phil. I'm telling you, classic Phil style. This, he just dropped this puzzle, guys. Like I said, I would be doing a special, special video when I got this puzzle. And by God, today's the day, baby. Yeah! Oh, man, all the way over from Walsall, England, baby, UK, I'm telling you, guys, do you guys realize that this puzzle right here just traveled over 6,000 miles to get here to this little state, West Virginia, by God, we love you. Check it out. Oh, Phil, man, I'm telling you, it's phenomenal. Absolutely, the bee's knees, guys. Check this bad man pajama out. Now this one, like I said, is called Bolted, guys. Very, very, very cool puzzle. The objective is to take it all apart here. Um, as in classic Phil style, he's uh, got the velvet in here. Really, really, really nice display box. Got a little card here, just as Phil always see it does. He said, uh, says, thank you for purchasing the uh, Bolted puzzle. Now the aim is to remove the bolt from the bolt. You know what I mean? Take this bolt from this bolt. Oh, and it is a bad, bad name of jam of a puzzle, guys. Now, Phil was very, very nice, and he had sent over some uh, some photos of this puzzle. So maybe if it gives you a little bit better look, I'll go ahead and I'll put some of those puzzles uh, right in here somewhere. So uh, with a minute in this, you'll see some puzzles. You'll see some uh, photos of uh, some better puzzles of, of uh, the bolted puzzle. Uh, so make sure you guys get a good look at this, guys. I'm telling you guys, go over to Metal Puzzles. UK, uh, it's on Etsy.com, guys. And uh, now uh, I have noticed when I went over there, I think uh, he's waiting for them all to be sold. Now I know that PuzzleMaster.ca they have uh, Phil's puzzles. Now I don't know if they have the bolted in. You guys will have to check. But guys, I'm telling you, there's a Crooks UK puzzles as well. I know that they sell Phil's puzzles as well. Phil Wigfield, buddy, I'm telling you. The bees knees, really, really, really inventive, great puzzle designer, guys. Now remember, guys, this is the one I had the interview with. Feels a bad mamma jamma. I'm telling you, he does this with a uh, a pillar drill and a lathe, guys. Yeah, check this out. There's no CNC machine here, guys. Look at the flawlessness of this. Now, you might have a few surface scratches, but that's just a hand quality. Now, I'm telling you, guys, this is the bee's knees. The absolute bee's knees. Now, <laughs> I have messed with this puzzle a little bit, and uh, I'm telling you, he is, is a bad man pajama. Now, there is four puzzles that I know that Phil has put out. This is his uh, latest. Uh, his last was Nuts. Uh, the one before that was... Uh, I think uh, Sticky Barrel, and then um, uh, the Spinning Tumblers. That's right. Yeah. All bad Mamma Gemma's puzzles, guys. I absolutely love and adore Phil's puzzles. 
Check this out, guys. I, I, just, I can't say enough about it, guys. I really, really can't. This is the absolute bee's knees, guys. I have looked at this. Um, I checked it out a little bit earlier today. Uh, it is uh, It's pretty, pretty solid. I mean, she, she's really, really, she's heavy. Uh, she's all made out of brass, guys. Um, I took these two nuts off here, which actually, it, it, did, it did nothing. It did nothing. I still can't twist. I can't get it off. I can't, uh, I couldn't figure out within, within five minutes, I couldn't figure it out. So, uh, on a, on a difficulty scale, guys, I, uh, and, and I want to talk to you guys about that as well. Um, on, on the difficulty scale, guys, I want to go ahead and I want to implicate, I've been a puzzler for a little bit now, you know, a couple days now, you know what I'm talking about, but, uh, I'm going to implement my own puzzle scale. Uh, uh, it uh, consists of from one to five, and now uh, the levels are uh, one will be like easy, and I call it gravy to uh, to five, which will be the hardest. Now on my levels, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna put this in when I'm editing here. Uh, level one to me is uh, is gravy, like I said, it's a gravy puzzle. You know, talk about uh, level two is uh, you know, uh, let's see, level two is hmm. You know what I mean? It's one of those puzzles that make you think, and you just go, hmm. Now, level three is a little bit more frustrating, you know, so I call the level three an ah, uh, an ah uh, puzzle. You know what I mean? Because it just makes you want to go, ah, uh, you know what I mean? Now, level four for me is an OMG. I mean, there's nothing else about it. Oh, my goodness. Check this bad baby jam out. There's got to be something wrong. It's very hard. So that's level four for me, guys. Now, level five, man's broken. Level five to me is broken, guys. So if, I, if you guys hear me say that it's broken, it's a, it's a pretty hard puzzle, guys. Uh, at least to me, anyway. Now, I'm, uh, for years now, I have been uh, debating on whether the uh, scale of puzzles, you know, whether it being from, you know, from five to ten, like Puzzle Masters, or one to six, like uh, Hamiyamas, or, you know, there's, there's just so, so many. So, uh, my scale is one to five, you know what I mean? And we got gravy, we've got hmm, we've got ah, we got OMG, and we got, it's broken. Now, on my scale, that what I would think, this would be, hmm, this would be at least a hmm, or an ah. I don't think it would be an OMG or a broken, but, you know, Phil has surprised me before, and I'm sure he will do it again. Yeah. But anyway, guys, check this puzzle out. There will be no solution today, guys, because I want you all to check this puzzle out. I have not solved this yet. So, uh, when I get to the solution, I'll wait around a while, because we got an awful lot of puzzles here at the Puzzling Corner to go ahead and show you the solutions to first. Well, we'll get to the solution to this bad mamma jamma of a puzzle from our friend over there, Phil Winfield. Excellent puzzle, buddy. Cannot believe I got bolted here. I've got all your puzzles, buddy. Can't wait till you do an next one. Drop me a line, Phil. Check it out, buddy. Excellent work. All right, guys. Yeah. <laughs> very, 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 very interesting. Very interesting. Now, uh, can you guys believe that, that this puzzle has, has traveled over 6,000? Right, that is mind-blowing to me. That, in itself, is a puzzling situation. Check that out, guys. Have you ever traveled over 6,000 miles for anything in your life? Think about it. It's puzzling to even think about it. Because life's a puzzle, baby. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about. Now, I hope you guys understand on my puzzle scale difficulty, you know, one's going to be easy, it's going to be gravy, you know, and five's going to be broken, it's going to be hard. You know what I mean? So, we'll, we'll, anyway, we're between there, you know, because it's all puzzles, baby. Now, I did... I want to give a shout out to my baby boy, Isaac, baby. He got the number, the secret number in the last episode, and uh, so I want to give him a shout out. Also, want to give him a special shout out. Yesterday was my baby boy's ninth birthday, baby. Oh, man. I'm telling you, the bees knees. I love my baby boy. Uh, he's growing up so fast. I want to stop that. There's nothing I can do. He's, uh, he's really turning into... A great, great little boy. I'm telling you, man. You guys would like him. You've seen him on here. Check him out. He'll probably be on here next episode, guys. I love you, boy. Keep puzzling, baby boy. Happy birthday. Uh, I know we just celebrated yesterday, but when you turn 10, 
We'll be there. Yo, check it out. Man, all right. Now, I just want to say, did you see it? Did you see any America on Flash before you read it? Uh, I was right here doing this episode. Well, now, if you did, take a gander at what you do right. Cheer. You'll be the first, not the second, the first. Go ahead and put the digits down there in the comment section below, like my boy did. And I'll give you a shout out. Wonderful teacher episodes. Now, huh, be good to each other, guys. Be good to your puzzles. Make sure you guys stop over there, Metal Puzzles UK. Get them any way you can, guys. I'm telling you, Phil Wigfield Puzzles, just check, the, just look for Bolton, guys. You'll find it. You're on the old internet there. And, uh, yeah, check it out, guys. I'm telling you. Now, I've got, uh, I've actually got the website pulled up here. Um, but like I said, it, it doesn't say it's. It says, uh, thank you all for visiting my shop. Please note, due to an unfortunate circumstance, the price of the puzzles will be increasing once current stock is sold out. I think it's current stock is sold out, guys. Um, because, like I said, I know that Phil has went, uh, I believe that's his uh, lathe there. Or it might be the pillar lathe. Is that the pillar lathe? I don't know, I have to ask you. But, uh, we're, you know, we're working on, we're, uh, Phil, uh, Phil and I, we were trying to work on a, uh, a video, you know, so you guys could see. Uh, uh, more of his shop, you know, and more about the puzzles, so we could, you know, get more of a, you know, uh, uh, more of a closer uh, uh, look at what Phil, you know, right, right, what's behind the gears that makes Phil. You know what I'm talking about. But anyway, guys, God bless you guys. Be good, guys. Uh, remember that puzzle contest, guys? Very next episode, we're going to put you on the old wheel, and uh, we'll see how it goes out. I can't wait to give you guys one of them homie on puzzles, baby, because that's what we do here. Puzzles, baby. Yeah. All right. And uh, until next time, guys, as always, keep puzzling. Move.